Now, our topic is bleach. There are two types of bleach, chlorine and non-chlorine. They belong to a class of chemicals called oxidative agents. They cause a chemical reaction called oxidation. Oxidation causes dye to lose its colors, and it alternates vital molecules within cells, causing cells to die. Chlorine bleach is used as a disinfectant in hospitals, hotels, and restaurants. The first chemical bleach, sodium hypochlorite, was invented in France, and it was called Java water. It is composed of water and sodium hypochlorite. NaClO. It is still the most common form of bleach that we use today. When we say bleach, we usually mean chlorine bleach. Also note that non-chlorine bleach should not be used as a disinfectant because they are primarily created for washing color clothing. Now, what do we need to be careful of? First, do not spray into the air and use it in a well-ventilated area. It is corrosive to our skin and mucous membranes, such as our eyes, nose, and throat. Second, we should always dilute the solution according to instructions. Third, store in a dark, cold place. Sodium hypochlorite is sensitive to light and heat. This is why its containers are always opaque. When sodium hypochlorite is exposed to light or heat, it decomposes into salt, and oxygen gas. Lastly, do not mix chlorine with any other cleaners, since it could produce poisonous chlorine gas. It is extremely unlikely that you will produce a stronger disinfectant. Here's what happens when we mix bleach with alcohol. We get salt plus water plus acetaldehyde. Now, none of these products are extremely harmful, but they also have no disinfecting functions.